Welcome, Pisces. <clears throat> I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back, Pisces. This is the second quarter of the year 2020 for the business reading for the month of a glimpse of April, May, and June. So, Pisces men 50 years and older, I see that this is going to be good. I see you stand strong, honorable, devotive, mature men. I see things are going to be happening. I see new contracts are coming in sight for you, Pisces. If you wanted to change a job, um, if you wanted to create more business opportunity, this is definitely coming up. So I see new partnerships is coming in. I see some of you have excellent advice that is coming from the heart, getting involved with cultural and creative endeavors, and this is going to be good. So wonderful alignment of energy. The king of summer, which is you guys, especially you mature businessmen, I see a lot of business is going to be coming in. If you have your own business or you're working in order to receive that, I see it's going to be transpiring. I see the energy of the world. I see a brilliant success. I see freedom to go anywhere in any direction. And I see new journeys and new um, business deals is going to be coming in. So a wonderful alignment of energies. Um, um, you know, you Pisces, you're ready for anything. Pisces, you like to have a strong financial stability. And this is really coming up. And I see opportunities, especially some of you um, opportunities could be opening up abroad. OK, so however that is happening, opportunities is going to be opening up abroad where it's going to be creating a lot of balance and a lot of uh, um, business for you. So wonderful alignment of energy connects with people, connect with situations and people um, to see um, how you're going to be creating wonderful possibilities in your world and in your life. And this is going to be wonderful and positive. So um, understand where you are, what you're doing, who, how can you basically create positive abundance in your world. All right. So wonderful energies, um, new business endeavor, um, new position. Um, a lot of you are going to be traveling a lot. So a lot of you could be um, traveling to create uh, um, other business overseas or you're traveling because you're working with an international company. But I see a lot of this going on. So it is wonderful. So um, Pisces, it's um, really a new beginning for you guys. Um, especially in the world of business, business is going to be looking absolutely wonderful, fabulous. Um, however, this is going to be transpiring um, for you guys. I see business is going to be looking good. Now, Pisces, let's go in and check. And remember, Pisces, if you want to have a business reading, um, this is um, via FaceTime. Um, and all you have to do is to just go on my website and all the reading within 10 minutes. I'm on, um, FaceTime with you. Okay. It says, um, so Pisces, let's see what is coming up for the Pisces. So Archangel Raphael, show us angels of abundance and prosperity. Please show us what's coming up for, um, the Pisces. So I see you're dealing with a fire sign person. I see the end um, is coming in for this fire sign person. Whoever this fire sign person is, um, this could be someone who was uh, running your business or someone who was a secretary, someone who was your personal assistant. I see um, a cycle is ending with you and this person. So whoever this fire sign is, I think you are understanding that uh, um this situation needs to end okay this business relationship this contract that we have together needs to end okay you're going to be finding out that this person has been deceiving you okay you're going to be finding out that this person has deceived you of a lot of money but also of a lot of uh, um business associate um this person has been um, using your um, information to acquire a lot of assets, money, 
and business however this person is doing it i see that you're going to be finding out that they have been working through your company or um you know creating this person could call also come in your life uh, um via via but is as if uh, um, some of you have a business partner that was trying to figure out what you were doing how you were running your business they gave you this person to work for you and now this person you're going to be finding out that this person has been a snitching on you and i see you're going to be successfully releasing this person out of your energy in june so this person could be um you you're really going to be successfully overcoming this situation because this person was placed in your life um and as you notice you businessmen it's as if you know you're weak you have a weakness for certain people in certain situations and you could have taken on someone or it could be a, a someone who have entered your life however it is plain however it is transparent you could have taken on someone and it is someone that has entered your life via other business associate and you're re realizing that this person have used negative forces either against you or with your business in order to control it <clears throat> and has been using you um, to um you know like um created their own financial stability it is going to be something because what is going to be happening and transpiring is like you Pisces realize that this person has been fueling off your information. This person is um, the energy of an Aries or a Leo. Uh, okay, so some of you are going to be having um, where you're dealing with an Aries and a Leo. These are young people and I see that they have been using your information in order to be accessing um, some business and using your information and creating abundance for themselves and it's coming to an end because I see they're they're going to be picked up they already may be picked up by the police because people in power have been um watching these people for quite some time their ending is here and you Pisces is um if you're an investigator or um you know if you work with one of these uh um auditing investigation but this is more like you are an investigator and uh, you are protecting a capricorn because you see the lies and the deceptiveness of a young um aries and leo and sagittarius that has played and used a capricorn information in order to gain stability in their world or in order to make a promotion for themselves however this is coming up i see you pisces are going to be ruling this month because you pisces men are going to be um protecting and ending a cycle where these two uh, that you guys have been investigating for uh, quite some time i see you're going to be working with a pisces a cancer in order to release uh, and heal a situation okay so there we go some of you the end is coming in to a leo man or woman a aries leo man or woman a cycle is coming in where this aries uh, or this leo person um it could be a business partner or it could be someone in business that has a shadow company that has been creating and bringing in illegal people so it's, it's, it's as if some of you Pisces is going to be finding out about um, a smuggling organization and it's as if you you are you could be a business partner to this person or you are a business partner or it's just that you come in contact with someone that has asked you about something and realize that this person has been working a shadow company and this um, whoever this person is have brought someone in your life because you're going to be finding out but um, whatever negative forces they were using against you and your business this is going to be over okay so it's as if someone had sent um, someone to come close to you either in a relationship to find out how your business was going um, or 
um, in your business or on, on the work floor. It's, it's, it's as if someone says, hey, I know someone who's looking for a job. You took this person on, not knowing, because the thing about it, Pisces, and when you're doing business, Pisces, you need to keep um, your feelings, your emotional feelings, um out of uh, out of your business world okay your private life is your private life at work you need to keep the focus and keep focusing on work and professionality because the problem with you Pisces is always that you're so in love you're always in love you're in love with this you're in love with that you always want to be in love Pisces you gotta be aware love is something that you use in your private life and your private time in business there is no feelings of love in business is business there is no friendship in business that's why friendship and business don't work all the time if you don't understand what is this about and some of you pisces and you know it's for you pisces businessmen you could have gone much further okay because there is so many people that has come in your life and has touched your life in ways, but it's as if you don't know how to um, create the void between the professional life and your personal life. You can't pee where you live, okay? It is just normal as saying you can't pee where you live. And whatever is transpiring, peeing where you live is affecting a lot of you business people. Pain where you live is affecting a lot of your business people. Whatever is happening and transpiring is that some of you Pisces have been peeing where you live, peeing where you work. Peeing where you um you you work is not the right thing. It is only keeping you down from creating. And I think that this is the quarter, especially in April, because April is going to be one of those messed up time where you um you kind of got involved with some people on the work floor okay and uh, whatever transpired you got too private and too personal with these people so what is happening now is that you are realizing um that um the situation um is getting complicated and this business um development and this business uh, um business is not running because of some emotional situation that is happening on the floor now pisces in order to run a business you have to understand business is business you keep love out of business when you're creating a business when you're running a business you're a supervisor or whatever you can't you have to realize that if even you have thousand people underneath you that you're supervising you can't fall in love with these people it's all about professionality on the workplace and i see some of you i've got yourself in this situation where you need to kind of figure out because someone got you by the balls whatever that has transpired some of you pisces is going to be gotten by the balls and they're going to gut you because they're going to be either bringing a lawsuit down on you of sexual harassment because this person is very devious um this person is going to be calling out on you and trying to ruin your reputation pisces keep it in your pants okay keep it in your brook keep it in your brook because whatever is transpiring you are going to be ruined by a fire sign person because they're going to be getting you okay this fire sign person is in another relationship with someone who is more prominent or a bigger boss or someone who's a ceo or head of something they're using you okay they're using you because this person has placed them in your life to find out but i see you're going to be finding out this in may and you're going to be ending it like you're oh my god i never realized that i was being used yes you are being used you're going to be ending this but i see the secrets is going to be coming out because a cancer is going to be finding out um, what has happened. The secret is going to be coming out. So Pisces, I am begging you, please um, be alert. Okay. It doesn't really matter 
who you are you gotta be alert as to what is going on around you because i see a lot of you pisces are going to be getting in the situation where you get caught up with people on the work floor that is going to be throwing you under the bus but i see some of you are going to be um having some secret for them and getting out of this okay so pisces i gotta go if you'd like to see the extended of this reading or want to have a um a, um a private reading with me you can use the link below so i see you next time have a wonderful month pisces all right